temperature is wild today. We've got lots of rain out there this morning, but we are tapping into a little bit of a break in and around South Jersey, even in Philadelphia. But even though we're getting a break from the rain, still some mist and some drizzle possible, and even some foggy conditions and reduced visibility. Notice that we have more rain that's going to be making its way up to the north and east here very shortly, and we have plenty of rain moving into portions of northern New Jersey and then places on up north. We'll ta taper to showers later on this afternoon, so every second of the day, we're not going to be dealing with rain, and I do think it'll be a little bit drier compared to what we dealt with during the overnight hours. So that's the silver lining along with the temperatures that are right now in the 60s. We have a flood warning that is in effect right now for much of the region, pretty much all of the region, I should say, all the way up into the Poconos. We could see some minor flooding in some creek streams and even some rivers. So I'm keeping an eye on those observations. And if anything does change, of course, I will let you know. When gusts, 21 miles per hour in Philadelphia, I've seen gusts upwards of around 40 miles per hour at times to around 36 in Wildwood. And down there in Cape May County, we've dealt with wind gusts upwards of 48 miles per hour this morning. So a very windy morning indeed. That's why we have a wind advisory that's been issued for our eastern counties, our points also all of Delaware gusts to uh, 40 miles per hour possible city and suburbs gusts to 50 along the coast so some isolated scattered power outages will be possible the winds stay with us into Saturday so keep those inflatables deflated but you can put uh, air back in them as we head into Sunday just in time to uh, show off before Christmas Eve and Christmas Day 63 right now in Philly 60 in Pottstown so that is the silver lining at least this storm system has brought some mild temperatures along with it we'll stay in the 60s pretty much all afternoon. Now, as far as travel goes, this afternoon, not the best for that. Windy but drying out Saturday. Sunday is going to be a great day for travel, and that shows this on your eyewitness weather seven day forecast. Monday looking good too, and Christmas Day as well. Chandler over to